I haven't seen Vraska's Contempt played at all. Oh, Sprite Dragon! Okay. Sarkin? I'm just gonna fire off Extinction Event here. I summon you. Cast a dragon! Glorybringer! What the heck? New cards confirmed. Uh, I mean, they, they're, they're gonna need like a brazen borrower here to bounce my monument, otherwise we start doing what we do. They are More dragons? <laughs> this guy should, oh, did they forget to give it haste? No, they must have something in hand. Or, or they could just be protecting their Sarkin from Guardian Idol. I guess is a valid play. <laughs> Popping off over here. Monument gaining two life is so nice. Oh no, I have one floating! <laughs> OP no! <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh. Okay, that's kind of rude. Don't doubt my methods. Yeah, the damage is done. I'm very close to dead. Extremely close to dead. I mean, everything only adds one extra, right? Doesn't it not matter? Oh, I cast what? Three, four, five. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Should be okay, right? Two, four, six, eight, ten. We're good. I guess I want to find like another uh, cheap artifact to gain two life. Nice. All right. Go back up to seven. Conveniently, my sideboard is already sideboarded. 
Do I play any 1v1? I've got a sweet Golgari Historic deck. Wait, what? Aren't we... Aren't I playing 1v1 right now? Do I plan on playing this deck for the top 1200 thingy? I don't... Again, I don't think... There is much relevance to me making top 1200. Maybe that was only for the Zendikar Rising Champs. I'm gonna have to... It's it's pretty convoluted. Like, since I'm in Rivals, I had qualifications to a lot of the large events that making top 1200 would qualify for you uh, qualify you for anyways. But I don't know how much further beyond that is. Oh, if you have a stream muted, ads unmute it. That seems awful. Speaking of awful, these hands are uh, kind of yikes. I know I was auto qualified to a certain point, but I don't know. Do I run and run into sensor? I don't think I do. Not in a rush. Correct, they have gotten very aggressive with ads, I do agree there. The hope here, chat, is that they don't have an abrade. Can we get a one time? Shatterstorm? That's the first time I've seen Shatterstorm in Historic. Actual world first right there for me. Ah, we can't win. Can't deal with the double planeswalker now either. Yeah, Shatterstorm's pretty good versus this deck. Fortunately, I do not expect very many Shatterstorms at all this weekend. Actually, tomorrow. No, it's tomorrow that it starts. Hot damn. This is historic. Well, this deck list is already submitted, so there's no point in me trying to change it right now. Gotta pick our choose and spots with artifacts. I don't need this. I need this. can blow your dumb dumb dollars in person. Nice.
So what I'm doing is is just consistently leaving up the ability to draw cards. I can sack the Mind Stone or whatever, you know. Make myself less susceptible to a storm. Hey, Scrybug. They kept shocks in versus me, so I'm not sure I want to uh, animate the Guardian Idol here. I think we want to just keep doing what I'm doing. I'm gonna get to ult there. Doo doo next turn, maybe. This one do one damage target player planeswalker and one damage up to one creature exile okay and then they can exile the top ten choose okay No, because if I run out too many artifacts, they might fire off the Shatterstorm, whereas what I'm doing is, again, keeping keeping my cards light. Keeping the artifacts that they can blow up light. I don't want to overcommit. This is... Okay, I'm gonna keep this. Twitch would yell at me. I did it the other day, though, so hopefully I don't get re uh, wrecked by... Copyright laws, issues, DMCAs. Near match, but they're not playing Gigantitha, so they're probably on the combo version, but the thing is, I get to resolve Karn first here. <laughs> this might just be GG. That's the funny thing. Sylvan Librarian, thank you for the 12 months. Oh, they are running the beacon, that's true. Just type exclamation point deck. Artifacts and nothing to do with them. Okay, this is kind of an interesting matchup.
Spirit Dragon is pretty bad here. Extinction Event is pretty bad here. I guess I'm just going to bring in... I mean, maybe I still leave the Ugin in, but... And I want all of these cards in the sideboard, though. That's true. Maybe it's better to tutor for the, the Platinum. Or sorry, the, the Golem instead of the Platinum. We just got a mulligan until we find a two drop, rock, and then Karn. Good enough. I'm gonna keep all the lands here. Race to Karn! Will they have a rock? Oh, that's not a Karn. Would be a real shame if I played Karn first, homie. I'm gonna keep a land, that's the one I want, but... <laughs> nice game. Hit five. Oh, and nothing to do. Missed an attack for seven. Oh well. Oh well. Who played Karn first? I did! Yay! Skill Gamer wins again. I mean, there are like no rogues deck this weekend. Yeah, why, why wouldn't you be able to look at your sideboard? Cage. Alright. So play, play, probably playing blue-white. Indeedly. start activating the barons here too. <sighs> what happened to Wesley? What's going on? Where's your new perspectives?
We have Castle Arden Vale available though. Yeah. Need to find our Utamag. Oh, I wasn't supposed to tap my archive. Oh well. I'd rather just try to find Ulamog than anything else. Real question is do I want to sack my inventor's fare? Go get Golos or something. This is going to go tutor for our uh, mobilized district as well. It doesn't work. It's eight on this. Yeah, had I gone for the scat or the uh, deadlines last turn, they didn't have the mana to make another token here like they do. They did have a shark, but we didn't know that. We're probably going to have to use a removal spell on Golos, which is nice. Keep up the pace. Draw Ulamog here, it's that easy. So we need to fade like the seal away. Well, that buys us time, a lot of time. That buys us a couple more turns now. <laughs> Look how many cards they have in their goddamn hands. <laughs> wrong card. It's a good one, but it's the wrong card. Now we want them to fire off a counter on this extinction event too. Wait. Oh my god, it's trying to use cascading cataracts here. Because now they don't have enough mana to poop out a token. Soccer! Thank you for the 73 months! <laughs> 
Chunk. <laughs> Obviously, no surprise that they have another Teferi here. There's no point in playing out one of these when I can only one out, run out one threat this turn. I need to wait until I can like mul run out multiple threats at once. Ooh, now they're gonna have Pact of Negation available. Oh wait, they can they can target my land with this, can't they? Yeah. The desert is sorcery speed. We'll eventually find a new Lamog. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 mana. Ooh, main deck disdainfuls, huh? I'm actually not sure what I'm supposed to do here. I mean, I don't... Like, killing the Teferi, I think, is what I'm going to do, but the issue here is that... I'm sure they have another by now. I want to make sure that I use Ugin before playing the Karn, because... Um, if they cast out in response to me casting the... Exactly. If they cast out in response to me casting the Karn, then I don't get to use the Ugin. Okay, their hand sucks. I'm surprised they didn't scry on upkeep. No, we're planning on killing Gideon with the Ugin. And the Gideon, if it doesn't lock down the cat, uh, Crawling Barons, the Crawling Barons is going to be a huge issue for them. Try getting through me. Okay, I mean, they need to draw a counter here. Oh no, they just tucked the Spyglass? Oh, baby! So, minus five GG. Cage on the battlefield, so getting the forge doesn't make too much sense. It does help thin the draws, but it might just be getting like another uh, spyglass. Because Golos just dies to wrath. I'm gonna go ahead and grab Golos though, because um, Golos still gets another land, creature land. Or a buried ruin. They did top something. All right. Well, now I'm gonna grab um, last number two here. Shark Typhoon. Ooh. I still think I named Car Castle Arden Vale. Let me 
just have a baffling in their hands. Now we can go get our mobilized district. Right, but I'm saying I think the Castle Ardenvale is still much more relevant than them getting one big token. I have too many things I need to deal with now. Well, if they don't kill Ugin, I can zero and kill the shark, right? Could they have settled the wreckage here? I guess they could. Eh, they can't make a. T I, um, they could have another shark typhoon, I guess. Uh, I'm just gonna attack with these two. Wow, they did cycle. So notably, I would not have had lethal if I attacked with everything. So there's no reason not to play it safe there, I think. That's fine. They're still in a terrible spot. In case they run Settle the Wreckage, I don't, I don't think there's any reason to attack with Golos. I could attack with the other two, fine. But the Golos is safe to hold back. And so if I'm going to hold one back, I might as well hold back the Idol to Tome. Oh no, I gave them the ability to actually baffling end my guardian idol. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Yeah, this is game one, by the way. Alright, I mean, they only have one card in their hand. Free artifacts. There are clocks, yeah. For this and the t tournament tomorrow. Yay! <laughs> it only took activating Crawling Barons ten times. But we did it. Feels like Flame Sweep is just better here, right? Because Flame Sweep can kill their tokens at instant speed. Though I'm not going to bring in too many, it's just I don't have too many sideboard options besides that. Yeah, we didn't even need Ulamog. Yeah, that was Merit Lage. Crawling Burns? No, 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 you mean Merit Lage. What matchup is the Platinum Angel for? It's not about match, it's about position. All of, the majority of the sideboard cards are toolbox that you have access to with Karn. And so it all depends on scenario, you know? It's historic and standard. No, I ended up taking the sovereigns out, or the the sovereign out. Ooh. 
Well, the deck list is already submitted and can't be changed, so... This is the list I'll be running tomorrow. I think I'm actually down on time from the opponent. I think they have like 30 or 40 seconds more than I do. Oh god, man, it is time to shave. Oof. Emily will be happy about that. Mm. Get it off! Scragface numbs, that's what they call me. Scragface numbs. Or maybe I just let it keep growing out forever. Ever! Is this the longest? No. How does this deck work against goblins? You need to draw well. And even then, you still <laughs> sometimes lose. Oh, they just conceded! They didn't even want to play another match! Oh. I suppose. 